Hi. Today we are going to introduce our robot, Ike Mini. First, do you think that you need a robot? Then this robot is the answer. Our robot has the features that makes our robot the best. First, let's look at Pepper, which our robot is based on. Pepper has great capacities but lacks some of the main needs. Pepper, Pepper, which Pepper has great. Pepper can perform nature, ba nurture baby, recognize and show emotion, introduce itself, find information, give jokes, translate, move around, sing and dance. Pepper is very expensive to buy. We are going to show you our robot, which will be cheap to buy and more useful. All right, and I'm Kay's partner, so now, now I'm just going to show you our, what our robot has more. All right, now our robot has more capacity and make our robot the best. New features include doing household chores, shopping, cooking, cleaning, and all those stuff that you need to do. Now this will be, now this will give a lot of convenience to other uh, users. Also, like for normal persons, like you can like can scan QR code, uh, and then he also has a 3D printer inside to make anything that you want. Also, you can prefer use GPS, purify air and water, and use a bad sensor collider to like sense around its environment. For students, you can like do you can like help do help the student do research. Homework, and you can also teach students. Uh, and then for children, you can like play sports, like teach, like basic alphabet, like A B C D E F G. Also, like you can like play sports with them and help them very close and feed them. Also, they have read a lot of a lot 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 of it hardware improvements. They're having like a advanced like wheels, which can like go up the stairs and then like never fall down, never, never, never ever fall down. Also like, also like, we add like wireless charging and guns, which can like keep us really safe in the US, which only applies to US version, where like other like China, they don't need guns, it's so safe here. Also like using a 3D printer, it can transport to airplanes, transportation, and, and, and anything you want. Now, I'll hand over the presentation back to Kay. Now, I'll actually show you our robot. Look awesome, right? Look at this awesome design. Whoa, look at this awesome LiDAR sensor. A lot of cameras which cover 360. There are rocket booster in the bottom. There is even an emergency stop button which can provide 100% safety. In future, you will see this robot in shop, supermarket, airport, and most importantly, at home. Now, after this presentation, go buy our robot. It's, it's only $999. All right, let's just go out and buy. Before that, let's have some few questions. Anyone? All right. Well. There. What is it powered by? So is it powered by air or is it powered by what? Is it powered by electricity or what? It's powered by electricity from, it's powered by electricity <laughs> stored in battery, but if it's the, like, there's a wireless charging system we should like to charge them wherever they go, all right? Over there, Jeremy? No, what about if the electricity runs out? Uh, but it also has a large amount of battery, so we can like, it can like really like even if there's a power cut like it can do anything. Actually, it can charge by itself. When it's time to charge, it can go back and charge it by itself. Yeah. Also, like in normal times, like there's a what you can like put wirely wireless charging things on the on the like ceilings and wherever they move around. All right. All right. Next. Um. Actually, I'm here to give you guys a suggestion. Try to make it air powered because it's really wasting electricity. So oh, air power? 
But like there's a electricity all around us. Like there's a lot of power stations. Oh, okay, I get it. Thanks. But what if all the power stations and the electricity goes out? I thought there's the battery. We can like we can like keep the robot alive, alive, like alive for more than like five days without electricity. Yes, one more. So can you show us the picture of your robot again? Can you flip it over? All right, we'll flip, flip it over. Thank you. Because I really like the design. I just yeah. feel, um, I really like to take a second look design. of your robot. It's, it's like so smooth. That, right, I just yeah. want to take a second look of your robot. Oh, so this is the front view. Barge eyes view, this is the lighter. The lighter? Yeah, lighter. We share like stands around 360 degrees all around. And the, and, the, and the front head is a camera. Yeah, there's a camera on the front head. Yeah. I have Any more questions? Um, how do you change the direction to let you guys see? Oh, where, where is it? Oh, that's Which direction do you want to see? I want to see at the back of. Oh, this is the amazing like. Gorgeous back of a robot. Let me see. What is these? Oh, these are the cameras that cover 360 degrees that make them will never crash, alright? What is, what is this? Thing? Oh, that's an arm, and you can like also like go into. Yeah, it can transform. Yeah, it can. Shape. Yeah, by like putting the arm inside their bodies, alright? Any last questions? Alright, no. No more. Alright. This is at the end of the presentation. Don't forget, go out and buy right now. It only starts at $990. Thank you.